hi guys this is me Sagar from SGN Real Creation and this video is about uh, my product like uh, SZ uh, TPS game kit or SZ zombie game kit a lot of people buy this kits and uh, they ask me to do a tutorial on how to replace a character with the new humankind character uh, how to change a zombies how to change a TPS main character player character so in order to change the main character of uh, this kit or any kind of kit which you can buy uh, from marketplace or anywhere uh, so when you you can see you can come with this mannequin mesh and uh, if you check the mesh there is a skeleton and you can check the bones name so if you are a uh, character designer or you are a 3d artist you have to make same kind of you know proportion of the body and same kind of uh, skeleton with the same name bone names then it will match with the skeleton and you have to use art kit art kit uh, which is provided by epic then you can easily you know replace this character without any problem in a seconds okay so this trick works for any kind of kit templates uh, which you can buy from my store or other stores so uh, let me show you very quickly how to replace a character okay so first of all in order to open your project or you can just simply add a marketplace uh, survival hero uh, why I choose a uh, marketplace asset because they are providing a correct rig this character with the perfect proportion proportions of the same unreal mannequin mesh and have a uh, same kind of rig and skeleton same kind of bones name so it will easily you know replace with this mesh so you can add this into your project or I don't know if you have this hero or you can you can buy a lot of uh, character from the marketplace so this process will work for any kind of marketplace assets or character assets so so I add this into my you know kit and after adding this we have to open this and you can open this and you can check this is the match and same kind of bone names here root palace spine one spine two root palace spine one so it is easily can replace with this mesh so first of all we have to you know delete this main skeleton so each and every skeleton sorry each and every mesh use this skeleton so we have to delete both of this uh, it is not a necessary to re delete but I do this for sake of time because uh, every you know mash use this and uh, whenever we you know perform right click and uh, define you know assign a skeleton so this uh, mash uh, skeleton also pop ups in the assign a skeleton window so we just totally delete this okay so it will pop some message blah 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 this kit uh, uh, this skeleton use all this meshes this all meshes use this skeleton so please don't delete it okay we are going to delete it uh, it will take some time okay done so you can save it so I don't I don't going to you know mess with all skeleton mesh because if I click this it will takes a lot of time because compiling shader I only open this and this because I already compile this compile their you know shaders so open this so it will pop a message oh man you don't have any violet skeleton no problem just close this or just close right click we going to assign assign a skeleton so here we have a zombie and we have a SZ skeleton so uh, let me show you where is where is the SG skeleton so this is our main character 
we have to check this as you mesh find this this is the main skeleton of this mesh we have to choose this skeleton for this survival mesh you know right click assign a skeleton and we have to choose this as the skeleton okay so when i choose this okay needs to be safe that's it guys that's it that's it it's very simple very easy so what are you going to do now just use a uh, survival one voila you can see everything is work with this skeleton so when you play okay so we can be going to play a level one with the zombie order mode it takes a little bit time because uh, yeah compiling problems I know my system is very lagged oh man I don't want to hang my PC Yeah, it's going to hang I have to you know it takes a little bit time for compiling oh man what's going on my PC is <laughs> crash okay let me close this it will compile a shader we will try again I know that's very you laugh at or at me I know that but uh, actually this is my old PC and uh, all my you know old recording things plug into this PC I already buy a new PC but uh, all my you know recording equipment is uh, with this PC and uh, um, that's why it takes a lot of time uh, so sorry guys sorry for interruption but it can but you can uh, you can clearly see you, this character work fine uh, for that zombie game kit or any game kit so it takes a little bit time we are going to you know try again give me a little bit time sorry okay okay come on come on come on, come on come on come on my PC you can do it you can do it bro oh RAM sucks I already I only have a 8 GB RAM into this but my new PC have 32 GB RAM DDR4 this is the old DDR3 RAM and it's really sucks so now you know that uh, Unreal need a good PC so you have to make your PC good so you can compile your shaders and shaders really sucks if your PC is not well like me <laughs> so okay okay so <clears throat> you can see this easily you can replace this and we can replace a one zombie also so this is a zombie and right lead you can find where is the skeleton so here's it's as the zombie skeleton so what we are going to do same we are going to do into mash so we can choose this mash now because it has also not a sand with any skeleton right click assign a skeleton and now we are assigned with the zombie as the zombie so now this guy become a zombie and this guy become a you know our player so save all oh man a lot of time so now this is become zombie so you can check it so we have to replace a zombie normal and zombie hardy so just replace a zombie horde okay so we just click it and 
there okay we don't know the name correctly name uh, this is the back back one so just click this and uh, come over here and use this <laughs> now you become a zombie okay close this and uh, let's play it again Did you see? But now it, there is a problem. Why why our shooting not working? Because uh, uh, we forget one thing. We delete a physical mesh. So this is very you know very important thing. Let me close this. Uh, if you let me close this also. Yeah okay. So we don't. Uh, <clears throat> we don't assign any you know physical mash if you don't assign physical mash your you know your shooting you know light trace not give a damage to the players so you have to choose your zombie whatever your zombie is i don't know you have to choose a physic assets i delete that physic asset but i use a zombie physic asset okay so where is the zombie physical asset where i put zombie there is zombie and we have to find the zombie as um, physical assets where is the physical asset hmm oh man here no not here Open this smash preview zombie. Hey, zombie, where is your physical mash? Why it's not opening that physical? No, it's open. Sometimes this, you know, fucked. I don't know why it's using this. It's okay, no problem. Where is that mesh? This is a zombie mesh? No, this is the wrong mesh. I don't know, no problem. I don't know what's going on here. This is the wrong mesh. But what I do is uh, simply uh, replace with the new physical asset. So we can go over here, open this mesh we need to find where is the as she mesh this we can use this mesh for uh, all of you know zombies so we can easily use this just do this shadow for shadow or zombie use this this save it and now everything worked fine because the rig is uh, same that's why it easily take that physical assets we need to you know down the size now our zombie take a damage did you see we have to you know Make it a little bit big. Come on, zombies, I will. see good zombies okay. so I think uh, you understand what's going on don't forget uh, physical asset 
otherwise uh, your right trees pass you know through the mesh so physical asset hit the line trace because I make that kind of mechanism so don't forget don't forget a physical mesh otherwise you will messed up everything so thank you guys I think this will uh, help you because uh, people buy a kit from not from my store they are buy uh, uh, from the marketplace also uh, so this is the easy trick to replace a character so you can replace with a girl or whatever so all the animation you know easily synced with any any human kind of character because uh, they choose uh, they use the same kind of rig with this skeleton you know body so they can use easily with a uh, unreal mannequin mesh skeleton mesh so thank you guys hope you like it please don't forget to like and please uh, 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 you have uh, I need your support you have to like my videos or uh, whatever but uh, uh, thank you guys uh, I will make more videos as soon as I get time so if you have any you know idea of tutorial I can try it uh, or you can check out my you know kits on my store so see you guys see you later bye bye good night take care